Every single time I do long screen recording on my iPhone or on my MacBook, I'm getting so much misalignment between what I do on the phone and what I'm talking about. And this is driving me nuts. So in this episode, I'll show you how to fix that issue easy busy. The solution is very simple. My main editing program is Premiere Pro. The solution is universal, so no matter which editing software you use, that will solve your issues. So on the right side, we have the regular screen recording, how I'm getting it from my iPhone. On the left side, the clip is fixed and everything is perfect. Like just check, on the left side we have hand, on the right side the hand already passed, so the clips are really messed up. But if you check the audio visualization, the audio levels are perfect, like everything is ultra aligned, but the clips are misaligned visually. Before I find the perfect solution, what I was doing is to chop the clips on small parts. So if I record like 10 minutes screen recording, I'll chop it on five parts, each part around two minutes, and then I'll just align it somehow to fit better. And I was struggling in that way. Now, there is a better way to do it. So what is happening when you do a long screen recording is that you're getting variable frame rates. And when the video has a variable frame rate, Premiere Pro is going nuts. I know that they added the support for the variable frame rates, but I don't know what is happening with my version of Premiere Pro. It's handling those clips horribly. So if you see here, the screen recording is 21.39 frames per second. Sometimes it's 21 frames per second. Sometimes I have screen recordings that are 40 frames per second. When I use my MacBook, my screen recordings are 60 frames per second, 54 frames per second. Every single time the frame rates are different. The frame rates you're getting will really depend on how heavy you're on the CPU. If I'm editing on my phone and meanwhile I'm screen recording, the frame rates are really low. If I'm doing some easy tasks like just scrolling Instagram or some web page, then the frame rates are higher. Now let's move back to the solution. As I said, the solution is really easy. The first thing, go to Google and write hand break. And just click the first link you're getting. This is an open source video converter that it's available for all operating systems, for macOS, for Windows, and for Linux. This software is extremely light and extremely fast. So I already have it open. So here just click on open source, mark the screen recording. That's my screen recording. And now everything what you have to do is to select the right preset for your video. I'm releasing my videos for YouTube and I'm releasing them in 4K. So click here on presets, Select web and here if you scroll down, you have Vimeo YouTube high quality and we have 4K. So just select it and no matter what is your clip resolution, the program will take the preset but export the video with the correct sizing. Here on the bottom, just click the browse button, select the location, choose and just press start. The program is ultra fast. After you export that video, import the exported video to Premiere and you don't have any problems. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial and solved your issue. Now go out and check out some of my other clips because I have crazy good tutorials out there and people don't know about them. So share them with your friends, destroy the like button, subscribe and see you in the next episode.